All right, in this video, this video here is a follow-up to a tutorial I did about a week ago on getting a user's Reddit Karma and Cake Day. What I'm going to show you in this tutorial quickly is how we can take any subreddit and we can get the number of members, we can get its Cake Day, and you can get tons of other information like the icon, if there is one available, some subreddits don't have one, and the banners as well. So before diving into this, I would recommend that you check out this Reddit Karma and Cake Day, especially for the Cake Day. In this tutorial here, I did discuss how we had to do a little bit of coding there to get the Cake Day to work correctly, and the same thing applies here. And this is a component. You can find this in my free components folder. Look for subreddit stuff v2. If we jump into that component and head to its globals, we have the URL, and the only thing you really need to change to get a different subreddit is to change this text global here where I have custom. Now in the custom subreddit, if I change this URL at the end to about.json, this is where we can get the information, and it's going to fall underneath the data tab. Notice we have the subscriber count right here. That's that 34,700. And then again, in that video I did last week, if we look at the cake day of March 9th, 2015, we're actually taking this right here, this epoch time. And if I go to epochconverter.com and I paste that in, let's convert that. Notice we do have March 9th, 2015. So that's exactly how I'm getting that there. Now there's some globals in here where you can change colors, heights, padding, the symbol colors, all that stuff. But the main thing you'll change to get a new subreddit is going to be that right there. So again, this is very similar to that tutorial I did a week ago. Let's just go ahead and change this and let's see if we can get another subreddit real quick. If we look at the KWGT subreddit, let me check on that. There is no icon for that subreddit. If I change it right here in the URL, KWGT, loading up this one. If we look for the word icon, I'm going to search for icon. We have nothing there. We have nothing here and we have nothing down here. That's why it's not returning an icon. Now I do have two codes down here at the bottom where it looks for both of those. The icon image, which is going to be this one, or the community icon is going to look for this one. And to show you that here, if we look at the custom subreddit, I'm gonna look for the word icon again. So we have icon size, there it is, icon image, we do have one. And then if I jump to the community icon, we have one there as well, but I have found sometimes this one may be there, this one may be missing, or vice versa, or heck, you might not have one at all, like I showed you a moment ago with KWGT. Let me jump to one more that's a little bit different. Let's look at Cinema 4D. I tinker around a little bit with motion graphics, so looking at this subreddit, let it load up, it does have an icon. Notice the cake day and the members have changed. Looking at the JSON for Cinema 4D, Looking for icon, notice the icon image is blank, but if we look down here at the community icon, we are getting a URL for an image. And that's where that comes from. And there you have it, very similar to a tutorial I did about a week ago on getting a user's information from Reddit. But now we're just looking at diving into a subreddit and getting information about it. If you like what you see and you haven't already, please consider subscribing. And if you have any questions, leave a comment below. And that's it for this video. I hope it helped.